Welcome to CAFCAST, guys. It's great to have you guys all back. It's been a long wait. So, what's been going on with us? Hmm. A lot of different things have been going on, so I'm going to be going off on a point form this time. We're not going to be rambling. We're not going to be all confused. We're going to make sure we're on track. So, today's subject, well, one of them is going to be self-awareness and talking to people about following their dreams and their passions and how to actually get that stuff started and where you go. You've already seen that we brought a few influencers on board with us and you've seen the movements that a few of them have done. Like Trap Tony is already in another interview. He's moving. He was in the news just recently. Darren's pushing hard. We have Vinyl Visions coming on board. We, we're making a lot of different moves. So one of the little things I want to talk about is being self-aware is one of the biggest key things to advancing yourself and pushing yourself to the next level. And what do I mean by that? It's finding the things that you're good at, tripling down on your strengths, and finding the people that you need to basically push yourself. And this is going to basically branch off into making people who are non-believers believers. And that's what's been happening to us lately. We've had a lot of people who weren't really believing in us, weren't believing in the journey when we first started. It's been about eight months now. and. It's been an incredible journey. Every time I talk about it, I get so hyped because now we're in a studio with a proper mic setup. We got good quality for you guys. We're pushing out higher quality content. And we want to continue to do that. We want to do it on a regular basis. I know I tried to promise to get it weekly, but now I think I will actually be able to keep that promise to you guys. And it's great to say that. So for all the non-believers, <laughs> we're going to make you believers. I promise you that. So now we're going to do a little introduction to who's with us today. Um, Tristan is a guy who's came on board with our company about two weeks and I want him to tell a story of like kind of how his life and the inspiration that he's gotten with this and what self-awareness can do to somebody. It's something that can change somebody completely in a completely astounding way. So my name is Tristan. I recently joined the CAF team about a week ago, and Cody's putting me on this podcast and asking me to tell my life story, and I'm asking, well, where do I start? Um, I guess my whole life I've always felt that I had a dream that I was never able to visualize. And uh, in recent years, times got hard, and um, you know, I was a dishwasher for two years while I was in school. So my, all my time, my weekends were gone. I didn't have many friends. I didn't talk to anybody. I was working. I was trying to make enough money to pay for things. And then I had to drop out of school completely and do full-time renovation work. And you know what? I had a good time doing renovation work. I'm not even going to hate on it. I, it crossed my mind even to go into construction school and do that full-time for the rest of my life because you can make good money doing that it's uh, it's backbreaking work and it's tough stuff but you know I had a hard head and I, I thought I could do it and then just last week I met Cody at a party a friend's party or I re-met him because I met him years ago he was dating one of my f close friends and uh, you know they broke up we disconnected I haven't seen this guy in years and I just see him at a party I'm like wow and he's talking about all these business opportunities and he's talking about you know making himself financially independent and the next day I just texted him I said hey man like can I be in business with you can I do stuff can I work with you I want to do something and he put me on he was super happy to have me and I, I feel so so much gratitude for that that I'm willing to put in a lot of effort in order to make this thing work and make all of us big and let's all become financially independent and let's not have to worry and, and work hard day in day out so just to get a few scraps so we can afford eating McDonald's because that's that's a real story you know it's like half it's like a half hour of work just to eat like a burger anyways I'm gonna pass the mic back to Cody thank you all for listening to me And you can hear the emotion in his voice. It's a very low tune uh, podcast today because just we're basically encapsulating all this information and the, the amount of moves that we've been making in the past few months. Not everything that we can talk about, but things that you're going to be seeing. And 
it's just been an incredible journey with these people and seeing the actual work that's getting done and making ourselves financially independent and, and when I say financially independent you think how okay well think about this if you have multiple sources of income are you vulnerable if you lose your job you lose your job you don't have fucking money you're not fucking making money anymore what's gonna happen you're gonna go on unemployment like people find a way to make money you flip you can go buy something at the dollar store and flip it online you can go buy something at a thrift store and flip it online you can network market you can move you can make positions for keys things that you want to achieve in life say you want to be a musician and you want to get to this producer then go send him a message reach out to him and be like hey man I would love to come work for you for a year I'll sleep on the couch just to get a bit of studio time you have to play cards to get leverage and it's playing those empathy cards at times. It's also playing, hey, I will put in the work. Hey, I will do this. I will first show up so you can build that trust. And it takes a very long time to build credibility. It takes a very long time to build reputation. And how that ties into it is when you have that reputation, people have more confidence in what you're doing. And it helps you. Do you need it? No. Fuck, look at Gary Vee. He fucking didn't talk to the world for so fucking long. And he made so many different side hustles, off baseball cards, off wine, off so many different things. He just hustled, hustled, hustled. It's a mentality. The difference between a millionaire and us is just a mentality. You want to achieve something, you have to set out the goals and be micro successful in every day's actions and macro patience. It is key to success. And who's going to be on our next podcast? It's going to be Thibaut. He's, a, he's an entrepreneur as well. And St. Laz. Hey, St. Laz from the young Quebec area. You know, because I say young to everything, you know, because I'm unoriginal. Sad life. It makes me cringe. But I'm going to love to have him on board, and it's going to be so much fun to have him here. It's going to be great to hear his journey. He's had a few businesses himself, and this man's a great hustler. He impressed me when I met him, and basically just blew my mind and also we're going to be talking about a little thing our uh, our podcast just got sponsored wait what sponsored what are you talking about vinyl visions are doing bi-weekly giveaways the link's going to be at the bottom it's also going to show up right about now and you guys can go click it out enter in that giveaway to get some free decals and custom designs for whatever you want we got a graphic designer who can do this shit clean i'm telling you hit this man up sell out mode a la max Anyways, guys, it's great to have you guys here, and as always, kick ass.